Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hermitcraft. We're here today on the top, the tippy top of the ski lift, the ski jump, actually, with Asuma and Wells. What's up, guys? Hey. How's it going? Guys, we have a visitor. Do you see that? Oh. Where's... Oh, There's a sheep. sheep. Yeah, he... Come <laughs> we on, had sheep. A sheep get, was... You're coming with me. Get in this boat. No. <laughs> We're running away already. <laughs> but he wants to join another one that's already down there. He's in a boat. I don't know if you guys can see him, but he's way down at the bottom. <gasps> he already made it. Man, that guy oh, got yeah. a high school. Look at that. Olympic a, sheep. A world record jump. Do you guys want to try this the ski jump out? Sure. Right, I, you I will do... watch you guys. I want to see what your technique is first. I've done this myself a couple of times. Oh, man. Ooh. Getting some serious <laughs> air. Oh, and go. then you just vanished. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right, Wells. Yeah, pretty, pretty far. Pretty far. You want to go first? Got a boat? Sure. <laughs> you got a boat, X? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm deaf. You do. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna back up for maximum velocity. Aha. Alright. That wasn't working for me. The Yep, that's oh. what happened to me. I went straight over when I tried maximum velocity. I, I'm worst uh oh, man. <laughs> worst jump ever. <laughs> I'm gonna go for horrible. minimum here. Right. Alright. Here we go. Holding down forwards. There you go. Uh, uh, no! Yep. It was okay. pathetic. A little bit. Oh. You got a little bit of height there. Not too bad. Oh, uh, I think my high score from earlier, it looks like you changed a couple of things. I think I got all the way to roughly around here is my best Yeah, jump. that's that's mostly like the maximum, like right here, so it's pretty much the maximum, yeah. Well, is there a medal be, that you win be... for your jump, Cub? Um, I'm, I'm going to give myself a raw chicken for the <laughs> medal right here. There we go. That's That's oh. the medal right now we got. We need That's to get cool. like a podium around here or something. Some yeah. People suggested that in the comments. So podium yeah, that's great. Yeah. That's not what we're we here need... to do today, though, right? We're Correct. here to add another event today, I think, right? Yeah. 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 A wintry Sweet. event. Yeah. I love this thing right here, by the way, man. This this looks really nice. Oh, thanks. Yeah, yeah. I, I went off your uh, your color scheme with the with the wool and the concrete pattern. Yeah, it's but, except it fits in without very color. Well. Without yeah, color, yeah, light. no color, yeah. but but same idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Shades. Oh. Now I extended this road here a little bit, so hopefully we can get some more games and some more stuff over here as well. I've I've got some stuff planned. I actually spent I actually spent like uh, uh the, on the live stream day we did the other day. I spent some time over here like building up an idea, and then I went and tore it all down. I, I didn't think it was good enough, but I, I've got another game planned for this area. It involves ice and boats as well, but it's not going to be it's not going to be anything like we're going to do today. Which, yes. Uh, Speaking of ice and boats, we're yeah. we're doing the uh, the ice boat race today. Exactly. Um, these yes. emerald blocks, you know. At first, everyone understood. Then you've got people watching who didn't see the episode that we mentioned it. And now I get quite a lot of comments asking about, you know, <laughs> why are there these emerald blocks everywhere? Yeah. And these are essentially marking out roughly the path of the ice boat. <gasps> Is that Churchill? Track. This is Churchill the Eighth. Yeah, he's been exploring. Churchill the Eighth. Yeah, yeah, man, he's been checking out the place. <laughs> he has really been moving. I saw him in the Nether earlier today. Oh wow! And he's all the way over here now, so he's been exploring moving. dimensions. Good old pig. Yeah. Yeah. So this is going to be the path. Are we? Have we decided? Are we going to make this on the surface or underground? Um, think... the path as a whole is going to be kind of a combination of both. Yeah, I think um, Setup's vision for this area is to wrap things around one another. So we've kind of laid out this to go between buildings so that it can be seen going between buildings. And maybe like over here it goes underground, so it can be a mixture. That's okay. for sure. Okay, alright. Um, but we did some we did some like redstoning earlier, didn't we? Uh, yes. Well, <laughs> yesterday for you guys, earlier for me in the morning. I brought mm -hmm. some supplies with me. Maybe we can mock up what we figured out. Where are we actually going to need a jump? Um, uh, well, if it goes underground here, we need something over and here, and then it probably. pops out over here. Right. So that's the place to build the there. jump. Okay. Yep. yep. So, Cub, do you remember? I think it was five wide, and then there yep. was going to be room for like, was it carpets on either side? Carpets. Yeah, carpets lining the side. Yep. That was the plan. Five. Six and seven. I think that's seven wide. In fact, I remember leaving this space seven wide. So we would have carpets on the edge to sort of signify um, that that's the edge of the thing. And then they're going to fly into some slime blocks. And we figured mm -hmm. out a contraption, a way of doing this that is pretty reliable. 
Um, how about we build it first and then show it? Because building it on camera is always going to be a pain in the butt. Yeah, why don't we start like digging out the pathway and laying out some stuff, and then we'll get everything together and uh, we'll bring the people back. All right then. Wells, we should probably head over to where Cub is. So <laughs> we've kind of been doing a little bit of just you know planning, figuring out what's going to go. The track's going to start from over here, right? Cub, you're going to demonstrate how this works. Hopefully, by not flying off the side. Yep. <laughs> so we're going to go straight in here. There's going to be a little bit of a drop. Yeah. We'll I like speed that. through. And then, and then there'll be a launcher right here, yeah. Right first this time. Thing. First time, man. <laughs> that worked pretty smooth. That worked pretty smooth. So I think Asuma set up like some type of uh some type of clock right here to make sure Yeah. This is what we worked on this morning. So basically the the yeah. trouble that you had, Wells, is that your boat would go into the wall. And that can actually happen with this boat launcher. So if I go forward Aha, there you go. Perfect example. Yep. <laughs> right, but eventually, eventually it'll work and I'll go up top. Might take a few attempts. Yeah, as long as it gets there eventually, that's the important thing. Yeah, yep. so the idea is that we've set it up so you, you know, you activate a tripwire hook and that goes into a little redstone clock down here and then that means that if there's like multiple players there or whatever, it's going to continuously bounce the slime blocks. So if you're stuck in a block or there's a group of you there, eventually you'll all get out. Uh, Cub, we could actually try and demonstrate that as well. Like, if you're in that boat... Yeah, both of us go in at the same oh, time. Yeah, like yeah, go, go, go. Okay. There we are. So I'm stuck. Yep. You've gone. Up. And I'll hopefully get there eventually. Um, <laughs> there we go. Finally, there that was a little go. bit punishing. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, that's cool. So we kind of settled on like a five-wide ice track here. That there seems go, to be... Yeah. A reasonable size. Uh, we're going to go for organics yeah. as well, right? As opposed to everything being like, you know, rigid, perfect corners and stuff. We're going to go for more of an organic approach to this racetrack by the looks of it. I mean, this bit down here is nice. It's very yeah. nice. Yeah. And it would probably be like too steep to try and guide this from over here all the way down there. So the drop was a really cool idea. Um, so what are we looking at doing next to this thing? Maybe some aesthetics or... Yeah, I think we should finish uh, laying out the track itself, like where it's going to go. Oh, all of the packed um, ice. Yeah. I think it's yep. okay. Idea. Yeah, all the packed ice. Yeah, so. Do some uh, aesthetics, figure out where else we're going to need jumps and all that kind of stuff, and uh, and bring it back. All right. <laughs> Alrighty then, this thing is looking pretty superb, I, th I would say yeah. so myself. Yeah, I'm especially a fan of all the dirt and mycelium, it looks glorious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the vein of my existence, that stuff, it's so ugly. So, where should we start this from? You've already taken to the skies, I see what you're doing, you're getting the old aerial shot in there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's pretty it's pretty uh, glorious like the track layout, but the the packed ice certainly uh, a bit of an eyesore for now. You know, <laughs> some building <laughs> around bit, it yeah. will will soften that blow. And then when you're looking at it from down below, you're probably not going to see too much of the ice anyway. So, yeah. should we start it from over here where we had the jump we showed a moment ago? 
I think we should start at the very beginning of the track. Ah, that's a good idea. I am running out of rockets as well, so we can't... We <laughs> so, Someone's got to chuck me some rockets, or otherwise I'm going to be hopping around placing slime blocks. Oh, uh, there's one dirt block on the track. Yes, that marks the, the start line, probably. Ah, this is your entrance. Or the approximate location. Yeah, this will be the entrance. We'll have a stairway that kind of comes up connecting directly to that road down there. Yeah. And then there'll be like a little platform here for spectating or the award ceremony or uh, tea parties. or Tea party? You know, I like the sound of that. <laughs> um, <laughs> Sign but me up. Then we'll, yeah, then we'll have the track here. Mm -hmm. Start line will be approximately here. Maybe we'll move it more like over a little bit. I don't know. Yeah. Yep. So that's going to be the start right here. And then we have it coming out over the ocean here. A and little you bit. You had an idea about the supports here, Zuma, like right along yeah, the I, edge? Yeah, I felt like that flat line, like if you look at where we got the uh, the train tra tracks thing, whatever, over on that side, very flat line. So over here, rather than have the same thing, if we got support beams dropping down from the ice, like... If they saddle over that line, it helps break it up a little bit, I think, you know. That that was my okay. thinking there. So yep. it curves out, it comes back in, goes across here, yep. front of Mumbo's game. Goes down a hill. And we've yep. seen this Falls bit before. <laughs> Bam. Underneath down the hill. Here. It's only got one tunnel. under underground section though. The entire the entire thing only got one underground bit. But like we were saying earlier, you could always just come back to the project later and expand it or like as you said, Wells, use like a, a redstone switch to change up the track. Mm-hmm. Which would be, which would be pretty cool, I think. <laughs> yeah, it would. And then That'd it wraps, uh, goes up over a jump, comes down here, goes up another jump, up to the top. Oh, yeah. What am I on about? We haven't seen it all yet. Oh, I thought... <laughs> I thought, like, we've seen that bit. Yeah, no. Okay, sorry. Continue. Ignore me. Yeah, so uh, some jumps and things end up in the sky... Wraps around past uh, in between False's uh, Hungry Hermits game and Mumbo's Slabyrinth. Yep. And then comes back to the start line, basically. Yep. And then we got another jump up here, right here by uh, between oh, yeah. False's and Mumbo's games. Yep. yep. An in the cool. air jump, yeah. That only goes up a few blocks. It can go higher than that. It's about 10 blocks it can jump, we measured. This could look if, great. Uh, though, like... it... Sorry, go on. It could also be extremely entertaining, though. You might have some people like accidentally launch themselves into the the pig pen. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. <laughs> I like that. Mixing the games together. So this is all in part with you know ZF's vision to have games tangle and wrap around one another and sort of be, um, you know, mixed or whatever. I don't know. Intertwined. Intertwined. There's so Intertwined, many words yeah. we could use. Uh, but next, shall we look at perhaps decorating some of the track, come up with some ideas for support beams and whatnot? Yep, I think that would be good. Uh, and and we should probably do the actual redstone for the jumps where we put yeah, them. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yep. I'll handle all the redstone since I'm the, the greatest of the three of us when it comes to redstone. And, um, okay, that's a lie, but uh, <laughs> I'll let you guys handle the redstone. And <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> and we'll I'll get start, on it. Don't uh, you worry about it. Yeah, we'll get uh, we'll get some progress done. All right. All right, guys, we're back. We've been working on some of the aesthetics and stuff like that, and we think we've come up with something that we like. I like it. I it think it's good. Especially nice in this area because of the greenery. You know? Yes, very much so. I think that, that it definitely helps a lot, yep. Yeah, we're thinking dark oak for the uh, kind of the, the, the border of the track. So, yeah. like, if you come over here, you can kind of see... It sticks up a little bit, to, you know, the barrier to kind of keep people inside the track so they don't go flying everywhere. Yeah, that's um, important. Otherwise, you know, <laughs> you might fly off yeah, into we a bucket <laughs> of lava. Yeah, otherwise it's more of a headache than a, a fun mini game. So Yeah, it'd be like that, what is it, Rainbow Road from Mario? Is that what it, where you go fly yeah. Oh, that one. Time? Yeah. Yep. It'd be like yeah. that. But this was looking nice. I like this, yeah. It's cool. We've got spruce wood underneath. I did this bit. Um, I, I don't know if you like this, Wells, but I kind of threw in some stairs off of the edges like this, and then as they start to like go around the corner, change the angle that they're at, um, just so it's not like constantly flat and like next to the the wooden beams, you do have some kind of shape going on. I guess that's what I'm yeah. thinking. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Um, I'm the only part of this that I'm not like completely sold on is the fences that I added, which are going to be kind of like a, a support. Um, but I think we need to try it with like an elevation change and then maybe I'll like the fences better. Yeah, I like them. I think it looks a little too low here 
just because you have to walk directly under it. You could always perhaps break it just for that bit, so you see it on either side, but then when you're walking through, there's just a gap for you. That kind of yeah, looks alright. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could. Yeah. Me option. and Cub also did the redstone. All of that's done now. So yep, all the jumps are up and working, so... Yeah, yep. literally just the building to do. Yeah. And then uh, we got to do the platform and all that kind of stuff as well. Got to make that look all pretty. Yep. Ah, true, yeah. And then uh, I think that's basically it. Uh, I say basically it, but it's going to take us like Yeah, yeah, it's going to take us a long time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We basically only have like half a day left. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty then. It's, it's got blocks around the whole outside. That's what it's got. Yeah. I think we could probably play test it. Play test it? I got, I'm in my acacia boat. Hey, wait, where's my boat? I've got two boats here. <laughs> Welsh, do you want one? I've got one. Okay. I'm going to use the dark one. It goes faster. Right. I'm sure oh, it does. I'm already spinning. Just, I just generated spinning. a lot of comments for that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. At Cub, you, you can't start with a, an advantage. Look at All that. Right, I'm cheater. coming back. I'm coming back. Okay. Trying I'm, to cheat. I'm here. I'm here. You're, you're still in front of us. Uh, it's I'll tell fine. you what, it's I'll give fine. you I'll give, Go on then. Lead. The, three, two, one, go. Three, two. <laughs> go. Okay. We're going. Uh, oh, oh, we're baby. inside each other. Okay. Now we're oh, back my. to normal. Oh, God. Oh, I'm yep. terrible. Oh, I've just oh, been reminded oh, of how bad okay. I am at boat racing. Oh, man, I'm on the edge of the wood. There we uh, go. Okay, I'm back on. Back on oh, now. Oh, look God. out. <laughs> you can fly out there. So we need to fix that, I think. Yeah, I'll all have right. like a glass wall or something. Uh, I thought you said all the elevators were done. Uh, you're holding down forwards? <laughs> yeah, you're missing uh, a, a few slime blocks on one of them. Got oh, it. that's um, odd. Oh, like a whole bunch of blocks are missing here. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, I'm up uh, first time. Oh. <laughs> I win! Lap I'm one on, completed. I'm on the ground. I'm no just going to leg I'm in the last because I don't know how to control a boat. Here we go. Leg it. Oh. oh dear. Yeah, this actually isn't too bad. There we go. Like, uh, <laughs> as, as far as being able to ah, get cup. around without getting stuck on stuff all the time. I think your redstone's broken here. Is, Is there it? a repeater with two ticks going into the piston? Oh. Yep. The, clock's, the clock on the side. Something's wrong with it then. There we go. I'm in. I'm around. You get it? You got it? Okay. Okay. Now that was fun, I think I... but I know that I'm going to be horrendous at this game. So I'm going to build it and never <laughs> play it. <laughs> and uh, lap two completed. Gee, showing off, you almost lapped me. <laughs> almost. Almost. I so, think it works though. Like it's uh, it's definitely doable. Yeah. This this is this is yeah. a good race. Yep. So what bit do we want to work on next? We've done some of the outside. What what bits are going to change up and look different or? Uh, you know that we could build uh, the underground section here needs to have a little bit of stuff done i think aesthetically okay a lot yeah, of let's, stuff let's done get that aesthetically done. i also think that the uh, the supports all need to go in cuz right now we just have like this floating platform and yeah. all that kind of stuff well yeah, this bit point. here i can yeah. get behind we got some uh, yeah we got some like holes to to fill in and then down here yeah we're going to okay. like make it all transition with the colored floors and then there's this little tunnel wells I see you got plain elytra wings. I do, indeed. Have I've, I've never been to a minecon. Need to get yourself a cape, man. It's a join yeah. the club. <laughs> yeah. I know, I know, but uh, I'm. They stopped doing minecons. How am I supposed to get to a minecon? And get I a cape know, I know what you can do to get a cape. Right, you just <laughs> got to go on Reddit and just spend a couple of years posting about turtles. That's all it takes, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So I've, I've filled in this area if you want to check out what I've done. Um, the top is just nice and level. I feel like the roof down here is a bit flat. Maybe I should have picked a different block or met, done a pattern. But the walls are cool. Uh, cool yeah, we can... Uh, that looks cool. Let me, uh, I'm going to put down a few. Yeah, a couple of torches light. for now, definitely. Yeah. yeah. And then coming yeah, out of here, it. like there it's a bit plain the way the opening works. But uh, it's good. Can I jump out of here? Nope. Yes, yes, no, I'm out. I did a super jump, jump like you were telling nice. me. Yep. <laughs> Just like that, yep. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Nice. Elytras are amazing. Watching people fly with them is just awesome. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to yeah, fill in good. like all of this with purple at some point, and then somewhere around here I'll probably transition to a different color around this area. But you guys have done all of this section. Oh, what happened to the slime blocks here? They're still there. I see them still there. Really? Really? Yeah. 
Oh, uh, you just went right through blocks. Wow. Yeah, they're so definitely gone Rip. on my screen. Minecraft bugs. <laughs> Wait, let's play some. You guys block. are like breathing. What? So they're not there. Right they're not there for you, Cub. I think if you walk into them, you might fall down. Well, I fall. Oh, I got. No, I got launched up. Oh, there's <sighs> one missing here now. I see. Maybe. Yeah, they're yeah. they're all they're all missing. They're all. I only see these like five right here. Really? Yeah. I'm seeing like a lot of these. Yeah, I see all of them. Stand, stand hmm. over. Sta wait. <gasps> <gasps> Standing on air, cheater. I bet if you stood there for too long, it would kick Hex. you for. Go over to this side. It might kick you for flying. If you just go into that corner. Right here? Yeah, yeah. Is it going to kick him? <laughs> seems seems just fine to me. Well, you are you are floating in air. <laughs> Treaty Cub fan. Right there. Wow. Okay. <laughs> that's yeah. kind of hilarious. Yeah, that's, that's bizarre. Uh, we also got a lot done, uh, like the underside. Wells and I got a lot done over here. That's what you're yeah. So we got some of the supporting structures done. We need a little bit more spruce, it looks like, down here. But yep. yeah, overall, we're getting a lot of this oh, it's looking stuff good. filled out. Oh, do you yeah, know what? It looks oh, nice coming out here into the water. Go. I'm glad to see that. Yeah, it does. That's yeah, that was a good idea. Yep. Oh, man, that's cool. Yeah. I think once it's all spruced up and everything, we have all the... Yeah. Different stuff think, in place and all the pack dice is covered. It'll look really good. I think this over here is going to go as well. I've been just trying to remove the mycelium just about everywhere because it's so ugly. It needs <laughs> to be destroyed. Yep. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. All right, cool. So, yeah, I think we just have pretty much the aesthetics to go, right? Maybe a couple of areas. Do we want to put um, anything over certain jumps so that people don't fly out? Or we just want to... We'll risk it. We'll risk them flying out, I think. It'll be cool. I think uh, having people, you know, giving people the ability to fly while playing this could be extremely entertaining. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah. good good point. Good point. So, you, you probably weren't able to tell, um, but it was kind of late for me when we were recording together. And uh, eventually I had to go to bed because, of course... On this side of the pond over here in the UK, different time zones and all of that. And watching the footage back and editing it this morning... Uh, man, my voice just, just loses its energy at night time. But I log back on and the first thing I see is like, wow, that really does look good, doesn't it? And then I start to look around and I think I think they've really put in the hours and actually gone and finished all of this. So I'm just going to have a quick look. Yeah, I mean, you guys should head over to their channel and check out all of the building that they did after I was gone. I just want to uh, pick up on a couple of details that I've noticed. Yes, these little fence posts look cool. And, oh man, they've done so much around here. But still a long way to go, actually. There's loads of stuff to be built underneath as well. And uh, the project looks seriously cool. Um, but this is where I'm going to wrap it up for me. We've, we've done what we, we've done on this project for now. And I'll be coming back over here in a future episode and working on more things in this area. But I think next episode we'll probably head back to the base, which is what I think a lot of you want to see. So let me know with a comment down below. Are you looking for some more base action or some more mini games action? Just let me know there. And uh, we'll figure this all out. But yes, that's going to be it for me this episode. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.